having a great day so far today. Today I want to talk to you about joy. How important is joy and what expectation does God have of us when it comes to being joyful? Let's look at a scripture in 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 in verse 16. I love this scripture when it comes to joy. Paul speaking to the church of Thessalonica says, be joyful always. Pray continually, give thanks in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Right here, the scriptures teach that there's one expectation. You should be joyful always. No matter what is going on, no matter who, what, when, where, why, how, you should always be joyful. Jesus didn't die on the cross so that you would get discouraged or disheartened by life's circumstances and challenges. We're to be joyful always. Now, in order to do that, the Bible says we have to pray continually. We've talked about prayer before. And then it says you've got to give thanks in all circumstances. We could talk about that later. We got to be thankful for what we have and not fix in what we don't have. Being joyful is about this. You understand that you're saved. And that's why it says giving thanks. It says for this is God's will for you and your life in Christ Jesus that's what it's all about. Your joy is not about having good circumstances. You don't wanna mix up joy and happiness. Joy is understanding that Jesus died on the cross for you and that no matter where your life is at, that love supersedes all challenges that you're going through and it, it makes you feel like you're worth something because guess what, you are. And so as we dig deep roots, in our relationship with God, let's make sure we understand what joy is and let's make sure that we are joyful always because that is the expectation. Have a great day.